Hi, this is Ray from Shaw Station, Antarctica. Today, May 3rd. Now it's 8 a.m. Minus 14 degrees Celsius. Still very dark. And the snow tractor is there, preparing for something. This time, I'd like to talk about meteorological data of Mount Fuji and make some comparisons between Mount Fuji and Showa here in Antarctica. The reason why I want to talk about this is I read a book, this book recently, called Fuyo no Hito by Nittajiro. Uh, this is book is about a couple who tried to spend whole winter in, Mount, in the top of Mount Fuji in 1895. And this story is really, really heroic. So I want to talk about this maybe sometime. So let's just take a look at uh, meteorological data of Mount Fuji. This is the wind data of Mount Fuji and Showa from January to December. I picked up uh, data of 2000 because wind observation at the top of Mount Fuji has terminated in 2004. So it's a little bit old but I picked up one of the data. As you can see, the top of Mount Fuji is much more windy than Showa, actually. It is because Mount Fuji is in the middle of the atmosphere. So, especially for winter season, like December to February or March, it's so windy at the top of Mount Fuji. But Showa is also in extreme condition. But average wind speed is not like Mount Fuji. Next, let's take a look at uh, instantaneous maximum wind speed. So this is uh, instantaneous maximum wind speed from January to December. And top of Mount Fuji is really, really extreme. It has like 40 to 50 meters per second. It's like 90 knots. At December of this year had almost 60 meters per second which is almost 120 knots also at Showa in winter season of Showa we have like 50 meters per second which is 100 knots this is also extreme but when you look at the whole throughout the year you can see Mount Fuji, top of Mount Fuji is really an extreme condition. Next, let's take a look at temperature. So temperature for Showa and Mount Fuji. In the winter season of Mount Fuji, average temperature is like almost minus 20 degrees Celsius in February. In Showa also the same similar winter season minus 20 degrees Celsius. But average is, of course, Showa is colder because it's in polar region. And during the summer on Mount Fuji, the temperature is above zero degrees Celsius. But in winter of Mount Fuji, is as cold as Showa. This is a minimum temperature of Mount Fuji and Showa. Minimum temperature is almost the same. Minus 30 degrees Celsius at Mount Fuji in winter. Showa is like minus 33 or something. So both Mount Fuji and Showa are really extreme position. So as I have shown, Showa here in Antarctica is a special place because it's in polar region and middle of nature. Also, Mount Fuji is an extreme place. It's so surprising that people used to stay there and did meteorological observation throughout the year. I hope you got interested in meteorological observation. Thank you for watching. See you next time. Bye bye.